Of course, he played in the Basketball Champions League. That's where he really raised eyebrows. Fernando. And does it count? Yes, it does. Well, that's tough to swallow for Uganda. Right at the basket with Wainwright and Ding, and they come away with nothing. Here's Fernando from downtown. Goodness me. Are you kidding me? There's the follow. The putback is good. But quickly, the counterattack. Childe Dundao. Angola don't give up. They race down the floor and get the easy two. Sisse inbounds the basketball. Oh, are you kidding me? Making it look easy. Montero and he is fouled. What a play by Angola. We're going to start cutting into this deficit here before we get to halftime. That's for sure. Still got six minutes to go before that. Oh, look at the bounce pass. Easy for Angola. And sometimes you just have games like this, but it's really all more to do with Angola who goes up. Fernando. And even though they've dipped a bit in the past decade, are we starting to see the return of Angola in this game? Well, here we are, and certainly looks like that as Lucchini gets out on the break. Dingu pulls up his dribble before he crosses midcourt, and it's Angola, in fact, who puts the pressure on on defense, and now they go in for the throwdown. Goodness me, Makonda has been terrific. And there's a follow. Finally, something uh, high-flying goes in for Uganda right at the buzzer. Look at that. The lob and the dunk by number 23, Geronimo Binguil Luis. Of course he can do that wearing number 23. Look at this. Wow. So Makonda remains in the game. The 20-year-old. And look at that. He comes out and gets a steal in the dunk. Good pass down low. And Dingu able to dunk it and get fouled at the same time by Geronimo. Oh, that was a nice move. I mean, Dingu, at least offensively, has come out of this game with a little bit of credit. Dundao rims out. And the shot. And that was an interesting finish. Almost completed by Dundal.